Alright everyone, hello and welcome back to Night in the Woods. We have just had our nice um, presentation at our friend's shop to help her out and she's obviously very grateful. Uh, she says, geez, thanks guys. I'm never doing that again. So what are we doing now? Well, I'm going home. Angus is making dinner and we're going to watch horror movies. Can I come? It's more a date thing. Oh, what are you doing, Bia? Yeah, Bia. Chamber of Commerce folks are going to the buffet out by Ham Panther. Kind of have to go. Business stuff. I hate this. But you're good at it. Both of those things can be true. Can I come? Nope. Okay, well. Good night. Night. Alright. And then I'll just be like a piece of shit over here, I guess. This is garbage. But check out that shadow with the phone. Don't you want to be friends with that shadow? What? The hell? What the? Oh my god. Hey, anyone? Yeah. Shit. Yeah, that was real intense. Uh, okay, we're going after him. Alright, um, this seems like a terrible idea. Anyways. Oh my god, it's the Ooh, donkey or whatever it's called. Pant Pant, where the hell did he go? Shit. Alright. Coming after you, murderer person. It's bound to go well. Definitely nothing bad going on over here. Oh, hi! Nice glasses? I think? Or whatever the hell those are supposed to be. Uh, May. Go home. There's a guy up there on the hill. He stole some kid. He looked like a ghost. A ghost, huh? Or something like that. May, you shouldn't be out here doing whatever it is you're doing. No, no one should be out here. But there's this guy. I'll drive you home, May. No! May, now. I feel like anti-cop is in on it somehow. I feel like that's what's going on, because she is just way too nonchalant about this whole thing happening. Every time we run into her, it's weirdly suspicious timing, honestly. And then she seems to not give a shit about things that a police officer should usually give a shit about, in my opinion. The hell? Uh, what? God, that is ear shattering. That's not as loud for everyone else that it is for me. Uh, alright. Creepy. Okay. That sounds like breathing. What the fuck? Okay, the long fall. Well, that was all perfectly normal, I'm sure. I mean, anti-cop practically watched me see an abduction and was totally fine with it. But, you know, whatever. Didn't matter. Kid probably wasn't important enough, honestly. Whatever. He was just a nice shadow child enjoying his phone. Alright, let's talk to our buddy. Hey, May, thanks so much for your help last night. Woke up and realized that I completely imposed on a big way. Or in a big way. Thank you. I really appreciate it. I'll be at work cleaning up after last night if you want to say hello. Alright. And this guy is working. Hey dude, sorry. Couldn't hang last night. Angus says he's sorry too. Band practice to... Toady ya. Oh yeah, good old Toady ya. Because I'm in charge and I say so. Off to work. Bye. But he didn't invite us. I hope there's not like relationships I'm supposed to make be maintaining and this is affecting the story. Hey, hun. Yeah? Come say hello, why don't you? Wait, are we still mad at each other? I can't remember. Are we mad? Am I still a shit kid? Hey, hun. Hey, mom. You look really tired. So do you. Also, I have a splitting headache. Well, the weather seems to agree with you. Gray and drizzly. I could go for that today. Dude, me too. Like, mostly any day. 
Hey, hun. Yeah? Sorry about yesterday. Me too. I said some stuff. I didn't really mean it. Well, whether you meant it or not, that isn't how we should communicate. I don't want us to stop talking. I just don't want a repeat of a few years ago. I'm really sorry, Mom, about all of it. Hey, May, you okay? I'm fine. Guess I'm stressed out. Or guess I'm stressed too. Saw some weird stuff last night. Or I think I did. Want to talk about it? Later, I'm still, like, putting it together. Can we talk about school? Also later. Yeah, put it off. No need to have responsibilities. Just keep putting it off. Alright, so I'm gonna go this way. Goodbye, lovely car. Do, 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 do. Going to my friends' workplaces to bother them. Kinda wanna go hang out with Gabriel. Let's go hang out with Gabriel. Nothing against alligator emo, but like it. I feel like her and I have been hanging out a lot mainly because we have and I've been picking her because I don't know why because I figured me and Gabro were already good enough friends and it seems like I'm kind of losing touch with him so let's go let's go speak to his face hole even though he's at work sorry Bia I'm leaving you temporarily and that's where that poor kid got abducted what if this is all like a like conspiracy in the town. Whoa. Someone moving in? Probably something dumb. I miss you, pizza place. Uh, please don't be anything shady. I don't need more of that in my life. I already saw some abductions and everything. Snack Falcon! How's it going, friendo? Sup, dude? Ugh. Uh? Long night, weird night. What's up? I'll tell you at band practice. Cool. What you up to? Uh, let's just go. We gonna head out to band practice? Yeah, let's do this. I feel like not enough time has passed. I woke up and then I walked there. Oh, I'm not ready for another song. Terrible at this. Hey, dude. You okay? You look tired. Uh, I was up all night. They were fixing the roof door and it was super loud roof door? Yeah, the door at the top of the stairs that goes onto the roof. Now I can, like, I don't know, run from that door down in the lobby up to the roof and pee off the side of the building. Yeah, maybe not. But what's to stop random people from doing that too? Dude, it'll be fine. Sorry, I'm just tired. Fair. Ready to go? Yeah, let's do this shit. Alright. I'm not excited for this. Uh, alright. Three, two, three, two, da, 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 yep, yep, this is a disaster. Dude, I need to be like a goddamn friggin', actually, I think I got this. I got one finger on each of the four keys. Get friggin' ready. So I was gonna say, you kind of have to be like a, like, rock band or somebody pro. Uh, excuse me? I am hitting those notes like a pro and it's telling me I'm not getting them. Well, I'm doing much better than I was before. Also, this song is kind of like too much in comparison to maybe what I saw last night. da 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 God, I'm the greatest at this all of a sudden. Burn the city. Down? That's like, is arson okay? Oh god, alright, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna start hitting buttons at this point, because this is just, yeah, this is too much. Alright, okay, it was going well. Pumpkin head guy. Dude, I rocked. I don't care what anyone else said. Yeah. They even said yeah at the end. Wow, May, that was uh, pretty bad is what it was. I literally do not know this song. I like this conversation that happens after every song. 
So fast. You just pushed a button. I am so tired. I strained my vocal cords yelling. Awesome. I'm gonna sound so husky. Is he down for that though? Does he like you being husky? And anyway, I don't even know if they're dreams or not. And this guy, who I think was a ghost, kidnapped some kid. And also, I think, was in my head after, while I was sleeping. And anyway, yeah, I need... Or, I think I need to do something, because this is scary. Well, that's not what I was expecting to hear tonight. Are you okay, dude? Uh, no. Let's be honest. I'm kind of freaked out. Probably wasn't a ghost. Yeah, probably not. Yeah, definitely. Ugh. Okay, fine. I'll go figure this out myself. Aw, dude, don't be like that. You got us. Aw, dudes. And then that weird guy sitting in the corner, who's apparently part of us. Okay, fine. So we need to maybe see if there's, like, some ghosty stuff happening around here, like, from a source we can trust. Such as, does the newspaper have, like, a ghost section? It should, honestly. What? Why is that a dumb question? You know, we could go check the library for books about it? No, they have the local paper on file, going back a century. If there's some secret history of kidnap or ghosts, we'll find it there, probably. Oh wow, I didn't know they had that. I thought it was just like a broken down old bunch of books. When's the last time you were at the library? We actually have one of the nicer ones around. Oh, how? Rich dude who paid for it way back when? Yeah, they set up a foundation and... Never mind, let's go. Can we regroup after? Uh, sure. Okay, we'll be back. Woohoo, ghosties. That's the spirit. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Ha. Spirit. Ghost. Not funny. Shut up. Whoa. Is this the library? Look, jobs. Weird, like... When this was painted, it was like, hey, look out the window. We're all working. Things are great. Now it's like one of the graffiti murals after someone gets shot or hit by a car. This mural is really affecting you. I forgot that we live in separate realities. Mine's clearly better. That's true, actually. Let's check out our notebook. Pumpkin head guy. The best art I've probably ever seen. Honestly. Okay, where are the newspapers? Hey! Closing in two hours. Okay, cool. Any idea where the microfish is? Microfish. Microfish. Third floor. Okay, thanks. Up, up, up. I didn't even know there was like a way to go up. Ring, 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 ring. Elevator phone. Hi. Go find the microfiche. Is the second floor, you dingus? You skipped one? Unless I'm incorrect. Uh, that looks like someone left something open on this one. It's a resume. Bob Targ. Born 1967. 50 years old. Let's see. Experience mining, construction, well drilling. I never think about getting a job when I'm old. 50s? Not really old. I mean, you should have money then, right? Ideally. Should be, like, guaranteed. Should be guaranteed in general. Gonna join my young socialist chatterbox group? Yeah. Okay. Interesting. I hope this isn't, like, the second floor, and I just, I totally did do that thing where I didn't trust my instincts. It's Charity Barity. What's Charity Barity? How do you not know Charity Barity? I assume this is something from school? School being five freaking years old. All right, so this was the thing you liked as a kid? No, I hated Charity Barity. It does look really hateable. It was like, oh, definitely cult. You're kidnapped by a cult. And when they were like brainwashing you instead of some cult guy with a wavy dagger and a magical mask. That's not... Okay, yeah, go on. Instead of that, it was this effing pink nightmare. You were scared of it? No, I was bored to death. It was 
or it was talking forever about being kind or about like being kind to others and like I don't know helping an old neighbor do engine repair that sounds nice charity verity helps old mr. Blanco fix his hovercraft uh, no that's the worst part it always rhymed charity verity pink nightmarity charity verity I just don't care <laughs> it's great yeah, this is this is the end of the second floor, isn't it? God damn it. Got off the elevator and I was like, you know, it would be really awesome if I would just go up to the sec or go up to the third floor instead of stopping at the second floor. And what did I do? I stopped at the freaking second floor. Did not trust my instincts well enough. Alright, let's we're going up. Duh. Who wants to be on the second floor anymore? I guess we learned the history of charity parody, which is a good thing. Oh wow, it's dusty up here. It's old up here. Sure is. Maybe your ghost is up here? Yep, ghost. Or something. Whatever he was. He walked through a chain link fence. Or flew over it. Or something. While carrying something. Alright, well that's even more impressive. So, we're gonna go find this guy. Because he took someone. And he's like somehow connected to this thing I've been going through. And that's not good. Alright. Crazy. It all sounded a lot more badass in my head. It's okay, it was fine. Yeah, that that sounded like you should be in a asylum of some sort, but alright, let's figure this out. Let's see if we can find any spoopy things. Ooh. Alright, there she is. Cool. Alright, let me use it please. So I have no idea how to use it. Really? I can't know how to do everything. I'm sorry, but what expertise have you brought to this thus far? The whole thing was my idea. No, your idea was ghost hunting. My idea is to do at least a tiny bit of research on it. If you think it's so stupid, why are you here? Because you're my friend, you asshole. That's a... Alright. Aww. Ugh. Aw, we friends, B-twist. Here, let me get this set up. Be here all night if your dumbass is in charge. Hell yeah, this sounds like me and my normal friends. Alright. Alright, so what are we looking for? I want to steer. No. Move, I'm steering. Ow. Jeez, May. I'm sorry. Alright, cool. Okay, 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 okay. How do we do this? Uh, step one, look at the screen. Step two, move around and look at stuff. Step three, find ghost. Sure. Oh, spectral happenings, duh. As they hiked uh, according to the lovebirds, a figure appeared to walk to the edge of the cliff and disappear, fortunately workers. They will locate any evidence. Hey, look at this. Hmm, yeah. Looks like possum jump. Let me read it. It's possum jump. Oh yeah, that's back up in the state park, right? Yeah. Ever been up there? Nope. Gonna check it out though. Go nuts. That's actually probably one mile, one mile, I think that's supposed to be or so from Miss Miranda's house. Back up in the hills, all kinds of stuff up there. Oh, well, I'll try to avoid any basements or corpse husbands. Co-signed. Sweet. All right, uh, that's good. Nothing there. Tail of teeth. All right. Is there anything else we need to look at? Uh, how about this? It's interesting, but yeah, not exactly about a ghost. A shot? If, uh, or shot in cold blood. Heinous act. Uh, okay, well that's, that's interesting. And then nothing here that we need, okay. Uh, alright. Just wanna check. Local ghost little Joe at it again. Oh, look. Scooch so I can see. Graveyard, that's a gimme. I mean, if you're looking for ghost stuff, that's where they make a lot of them. Looks like they saw him in the old section. Oh, cool, that's where his grave is. I'm actually interested in that. How could you not be interested? 
this is like, or this is like actual dangerous ghost stuff. I like history. Ghosts are history. History that won't stay history. Ha ha ha. That's actually pretty good. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. It's pretty sweet. Alright, um... Uh, yeah, that's kind of creepy. Um, progress. Um, find a groundhog. Okay. So, I think that's all we needed. Yeah, okay, we're back to this one. How do I leave again? How, how do I actually get out of here? For real, though. How do I leave? How do I leave the land? Uh, I'm now pressing all the buttons on my computer to try to get me to leave this hellish situation. Escape! Escape is not working. Am I supposed to find something else? Alright, read more. No ghost. Alright. No ghost here. Yeah, I am aware. Can we read about little Joe again? Will that set something off? No. Nope. Alright. Just gonna let them talk through this and then hope they will let me out of here. All this mine talk is really interesting though. It's like a bunch of shit happened in the mines. I know there's no ghost here, but you won't let me leave. Can we read? No, we can't do that again. Alright, cool. Oh, damn. Here's something we needed. Cool. Hey, hey, hey. Ghost spotted. Historical society? History that won't stay history in a history place. History place? Yeah, I've never been. You didn't go back in school? I think this was when I wasn't in school. Oh, after the softball incident. Yeah, mostly just watched TV and did therapy. Well, it's actually a pretty cool old house. It used to be owned by one of the mine owners or something. Railroad, mine, steel mill, something like that. An actual haunted house. Uh, no. Elementary school kids are there all the time. They have like summer arts and crafts program. Oh, well, still worth checking out. Okay, well, that's like three leads. Let's boogie. Let's boogie. Also, is that it? Uh. Uh, yeah. Alright. May Borowski, a detective of ghosts. Alright, alright, let's go. I figure three is enough. Um, we could look around the page for more, but I don't know. So we've got some leads. Can I borrow your car this week? Do you even have a license? I mean, no, regardless, but do you? Nope. No license, no credit cards, don't believe in money. You just believe in other people's cars and money. I didn't choose to be born into this society. Okay, well, I have, you know, a job. So I can't drive you around to all these spots. I can maybe do the graveyard? I need to go there anyway. Cool, I'll see if Greg wants to do the other two. You know, like, and probably... And I probably don't have to say this, but just because something happened in the past doesn't mean it's going to happen again. Hey, nerd. Ever hear that history repeats? It does. It does the same thing over and over again. We've just been in a loop since we're living in caves? Yeah, that's science. Oh my freaking god. That would be really trippy, just saying. Alright. Hello, people. How's it going? Ahem. What is... Shh. Is that Miss Quelsey? Oh wow, I haven't seen her since graduation. She was always kind of a badass. School district did not fund that art program at all, but she made it work. She was like some sort of art teacher survivalist. Wow, I never realized. I think they pay her in bits of string and empty soda cans. Thank you all for coming to this second meeting of the Possum Springs Poetry Society. You want to stick around for this? Uh, nah. Public poetry performance should probably be outlawed. When have you ever seen one? School, old roommate. You've never mentioned your old roommate. 
She's an entire story unto herself. Excuse me, are you two staying? If so, would you like to have your conversation up here? No to both. Not that big into rhyming everything we say. Peace. Poetry doesn't have to rhyme. It's the stupidest thing I have ever heard. Come on, have an open mind about all this. Poetry can be different things. Okay, thanks for coming. We live here. Right, so... Found out anything about your ghost? Yeah. Tell him, Bia. There were some newspaper clippings that talked about a ghost. Not just any ghost, Little Joe. Yeah, everyone knows who that is. I don't really remember Little Joe. He's a ghost miner. He died in mysterious circumstances. Wow. I know, right? Mysterious. I thought you were, like, afraid of this ghost. Like, filled with dread and shit. I'm terrified. Okay. So I mentioned, so it mentioned three different places we can all check out. Uh, I have work and stuff. Yeah, Greg and I also have work. You guys skip out on work all the time. Maybe we can, like, split this up. Share custody of you and your ghost. What places were you thinking about? The graveyard. She gets that one. Close and not illegal. Is there an illegal one? course he'd be down for that sure is the historical society you know you don't have to like break in the people there get paid to show it to you anyway i'm in for the historical society awesome so what did i get stuck with possum jump i know possum jump we used to go there in scouts perfect okay i need to act i need to like actually get home and do work it's gonna be awesome and also I'm scared to death well that's how you know it's gonna be awesome honestly hi papa erg yeah seems like that's going around the erg yuppers so uh, you and mom had a bit of a fight yesterday huh yeah I thought you two were getting along uh, we are just a bump you two always two alike, I guess. I got your chill and her smart assness. I just hate to see you two on the outs again. It'll be fine, we're cool. Speaking of mother, is she here? No. Mother. Hello, mother. But she's not home. Is she in here? <gasps> I can, oh yeah, it's this thing. Yeah. Dad, move him. It's only fair. Well, that'd be an interesting area to explore at some point. Uh, Alright. This clock is scary. Like you, but different, huge, and spooky, making weird noises at night. Alright, well, glad we could have that little conversation with our clock. It felt very important. Alright. Let's check out the compota. See if we got anything. Got this. Hey, May. Let me know when you want to go to the park. I looked up a map, and it's a pretty straight shot to Possum Jump. Oh, great. We never really got a chance get a chance to hang out. It'll be fun, I think. Okay, I'm going to sleep. Night, sir. Tips hat. Yo, I looked up the historical society on the internet. It's real old, but then they did big renovations. Oh, really? I mean, listen, I'm not saying there's a ghost, but old stuff that just got torn up seems like ghost central. How so? You're a ghost hanging out in an old house, and then someone puts a pool where you died or something. Haunted pools would actually be... would actually pee scary. I'm spooked. I'm going to bed. Alright, have fun being spooked. Spook sleeping. Hey, let me know when you want to hit the cemetery. I should be around most nights this week. IDK, thanks, Via. Don't thank me too hard. I'm going there anyways, and it's like right down the road. You're ruining this. Oh, in that case, you are so incredibly welcome and also better not forget this big favor. That's more like it. I'm falling asleep. Had fun tonight. Sorry if I was grouchy. It's just, it's just, just, it's fine. Wait, did you fall asleep? Lol. Yes, she said she was. All right, I'm ready to have another fever dream. Let's go to Nine-Eye. Yes, it's to bedtimes. 
No, no, I don't like when it asks me simple questions like if it's time to go to sleep. I'm, I'm a little worried as to if I'm missing something. But hey, whatever. Fever dream away. Oh, there's, there's four freaking bell towers. All right. All right, all right. I'll spend some time in this psycho fever dream. Looking for some bell towers. Is there one down here, maybe? Uh, 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 okay, terrifying fish. I don't want you anywhere near me. Ever. Okay. There was no bell tower down there. That's disappointing. I was hoping there would at least be something. Hey, how's it going, terrifying shadow fish? Get out of here. I need your fish kind here. Alright, this is gonna be a really long one, I feel like. I haven't found a single one yet. And it's also like the twistiest, turniest one I've ever found so far. Hello. Bell tower thing. Some beautiful music you're playing. No fish. What the hell did I tell you? you not to do fish things. Pisses me off. Oh, here's another one. Sweet. Alright, that one wasn't that hard. It's nice to know. Okay, well there's two down in much shorter of a time than I thought I would have originally. So, I'll take it. Is there going to be another one, like, right down here? Or is it not going to be that easy? No, two were, two were down low, so two are going to be up high, I feel like. I like the really pretty violin music in the background though. It's pretty sweet. Oh, there's another one accidentally. Have we got that one? Just got the one more, wherever the hell it is. Hi, spooky. Spooky shadow person. How's it going? I'm gonna try to jump up to you. Ha! Figured that might work. Let's get back up here and see if we can't find the last one. Fish, I'm serious. I took a lot of drugs before bed, obviously. Given my weird ass fever dreams every single night. Honestly, we should be talking to a therapist about these freaking dreams. Anger management is important, I guess, but seriously, the dreams, actually actually have to do something. I'm gonna go check up there because I really don't want to jump off that edge looking for something and then have to go all the way up again. So we're gonna check over here and then worst case scenario we jump off that edge to see if there's anything we missed up there. Alright, do to do, do, let's not jump off because that will harm our progress very greatly and I will not be a happy camper. Alright, so, aha, uh -huh, there it is. See? We would have jumped off the edge of that for nothing. Do to do, do, playing the saxophone. Alright, up, 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 almost. Alright, drug trip me, yo. Oh, the giant demon bird caught the fish. And now I'm flipping out and I pass out. That's probably always healthy. <laughs> well, I guess we can hope she's okay. Kind of. Maybe. Alright. Welcome back to the real world, girlfriend. Are you awake yet? Is it just pretty music playing? Dude, I can't wait to go to the graveyard. It's gonna be awesome. Gonna find, like, secrets about ghosts and stuff. It's gonna be sweet. All right, I'm gonna end the episode here because we're now done with our drug-fueled fever dream. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, or subscribe. It helps me know you're enjoying the content I'm putting out and that I should be putting out more. Um, and we'll see you in the next one, everyone. Bye-bye.